I knew I wanted to be a doctor from a very young age. Uh, I always wanted to be a pediatrician and work with kids. And then I went to medical school, the University of Louisville, and then I got into the operating room and I just I found my place. I decided to go ahead with general surgery and then I matched into my general surgery residency in Cincinnati, Ohio. My name is Kristen Williams. I'm a general surgeon at Baptist Health Paducah in Paducah, Kentucky. Paducah was very appealing to me. Um, I wanted a general surgery practice and you know in larger towns you kind of do have to pick a specialty. I mean we loved Cincinnati but it wasn't home. So being able to provide high quality care to patients from a true general surgery standpoint, that's wonderful. I, the breadth of practice is amazing. The patient connections are amazing. I love practicing here. Coming here was always just coming home. I went to school here from preschool through senior year of high school, and I was that kid in high school that said I was never moving home. <laughs> I thought it was too small. And I met my husband, John, when I was in college, and he was also from Paducah and we decided we wanted to raise our family here. Um, but it's been really special to watch my kids have a lot of the same experiences I had growing up. Besides, you know, being able to raise family and raising my kids around their family, which was a huge draw for us. The other draw for me from a career standpoint is it's just a different way of practice. So when I moved here, I started working at Baptist Health Paducah. And I will say from day one, I came in and I might have scared them a little bit. Because <laughs> I was like my first week here and I went to administration and the foundation. And I said, okay, here are my goals. Here are the things we need to better serve this community. The closest big city is Nashville, which is two and a half hours away. And a lot of our patients, it's just not feasible for them to drive that far for doctor's appointments, surgeries, chemo treatments, radiation treatments. So it's great to be able to offer them full spectrum breast cancer care here in Paducah. I think continuous innovation for breast cancer treatment is even more important in rural locations. You know, when you live in a big city, there are so many options for where you go for your treatment. You can go to a different hospital on every corner, so you can pick and choose you know, which place you think has the newest, latest, and greatest. But if you're in a small town, you don't have those options. So if we as a system don't continue to improve and use the newest technology, our patients aren't going to have access to that. But within a year, we had gotten new technology for breast cancer patients. We got MagSeed and MagTrace and the Endomag system. And now we also offer reconstruction. So we have the full spectrum of breast cancer care. And I think not only do MagSeed and MagTrace help us treat their cancer, but they also improve a patient's journey from a mental standpoint. And what I mean by that is the alternative is something like a wire. And a wire localization for breast cancer is very uncomfortable for the patients and it's traumatizing for some of our patients. I heard all kinds of horror stories, but it was nothing like that at all. Dr. Williams is superb. She reassured me that things was gonna be fine, and I believed her, and it worked out good. My patients have told me that getting a vaccine placed is the exact same as their biopsy, uh, which is nice because they know what to expect, and they can you know, be prepared, and they numb it up, and they say it's minimal pain, and most of them don't even need anything for pain, medi like pain medication-wise afterwards. When a patient is diagnosed with breast cancer, one of the things we do at their time of surgery is check their lymph nodes to make sure that they are not involved and to accurately stage the patient. And there are two ways to do that. You can either use a radioactive injection or you can use MagTrace. MagTrace is wonderful because you can do it when the patient is asleep in the operating room and so they don't feel the injection. I never thought uh, that I would be able to have this type of care in Paducah. I've always heard my friends having to travel outside to neighboring towns, cities. When I found out that Dr. Williams was here um, and met her, I just, I, I just knew we had a good, good combination. She did tell me she was from here and come back because she saw the need to, for her services here in Paducah and she was right, we needed her. When you practice somewhere like Cincinnati, you never see your patients again. Here, every patient I meet has some connection to me, my family, my husband's family, something. Something about that is just so special. And the bond you form with a patient when they literally put their life in your hands is so humbling. Uh, it's unlike any other bond you could form with a complete stranger. When you talk about taking care to smaller markets and offering the best care possible in every small market across the U.S., because most people don't get treated in a major academic institution. So technology that continues to improve and is easy for staff to use and easy for the hospital to acquire and the, for a company that's willing to work with hospitals to get their equipment available for patients, it's just so special. 